All right, bye mom. So today, so today I'm going separately and this pretty lady will not be with me today. Look at this Ruby. Please come first, come with. Ruby is saying, they are planning to leave me? Oh my God, we need to run. I think we caught the car on time. Oh, what happened here? It's wet. We are going to see a museum extremely late. Because of you. Bye. It's probably going to be a rough day. We are finding the end of this line and there is literally no end. This is all a big line. I can't believe it's such a great line. I wonder when will we find the line's end. Really a big line, never ending. Oh dear, the line goes all the way to Mars. So there is a different line for gents and there is a huge massacre here. This city has a lot of population explosion I must say. Ladies lines, gents line. Ladies line, gents line. Terrible, terrible arrangement. We had to go back to keep our bags. I had to take off the gorilla pod, tripod and just terrible arrangement. Now we gotta go back in the line. It's not really that big of a deal but we lost our position and grandpa must already be inside. Look at the crowd for the museum. Heavy, serious crowd. Just chill dude walking in the clock room. Look, so many people here for the clock show. Let me show you where the clock is.
a story. It's nothing related to the trip. So it's nothing related to the trip or the day. But I just want to share something about my grandfather one. In the Iran videos, if you might have watched those. Hi. So we came here. Had a good sleep? No? Couldn't sleep? Why? Oh, you were awake. I was just trying to rec... Okay. So, uh, sorry for that. Where were we? Uh, yeah, I was sharing something about my grandfather. This is my second trip with him. Well, not practically him because I'm not really staying with him. But when we were little kids, I used to always wait for the night to come. Because my grandfather used to share great stories. I mean, bedtime stories, personal related stories, how his childhood was and how it is different from our childhood that we are living. So, I really love listening to those stories. And while growing up, I wish that maybe even I would be able to tell a better story or a greater story. Well, I don't know better or greater, but definitely a different story. Yeah, I mean, I'm blessed to have grandparents. Uh, lucky, lucky to have grand, such great grandparents. I mean, not great, great grandparents, but grandparents who are great. And they really love us. I love listening to these stories. They were like basically bedtime stories of, you know, kind of uh, personal stories, like how they grew up in a strict environment. I'm in my room now, just about to take a quick power nap. So currently it's 7.10 pm in the evening and there's this nice light and we're just gonna check out the place because we're gonna have dinner today right here in the club itself and let's see how it goes. Still this camera has good low light quality. Okay guys, guys, we have explored something. Let's go up. Yes, we can. Guys, if we cannot, we'll definitely go. Okay, just look behind. So guys, this is my cousin. <laughs> I'm gonna fall. She has natural pretty long hair which are straight. Okay, I'll just edit that part out. You are not putting me Oh, fuck. Guys. Where are, where are the most One second, let me record myself. Guys, we have just sneaked onto some... Fuck! We have just sneaked onto some terrace without any permission. I don't know where we are. Oh my god, people are looking at us. We better stay low key on this, huh? Thank you, okay, thank you very much. I really appreciate your uh, smartness and lightning. Oh yeah, I can't believe man. We should take pictures but there's no light. So it's probably quite dark but let me tell you all, we have climbed yet another set of stairs. And I don't think it's allowed by the authorities but it's not really the craziest thing I've done so far. But oh my god, where are they going behind that door? Fucking idiots! Where are we? Yeah, I know. Oh, game Oh, they would like it, guys. Just say something, guys. So this place was discovered by this little brat. Yes. Yes. It was on her behest. So dark. I don't think people can see us. I think we should not make any noise. That's the only rule of the club. And if anyone catches us, I'll say, oh, sorry. Point it towards the mirror. Let us all stand. It's scary. Can you see my camera? <laughs> yeah, some people.
Yeah, have they left?